Hi folks, Joe Stedman here today to talk a little bit about escaping a buried lie in the deep rough. So what we want to do when we find ourselves in a situation where our ball is buried deep in the rough, first of all, we have to uh, adjust our expectations a little bit uh, for the outcomes of this shot. Um, we're not necessarily going to be, go, be able to go right for the green um, all the time, and it's more important just to get the ball out of this situation and back into the short grass. So what we want to do is pick a club with a little more loft and bounce. Um, anywhere between a wedge and an 8-iron is, is preferable. Uh, I have an 8-iron here in this example. And what we want to do when we set up, okay, is we want to set up with the ball a little bit behind or back in the stance, and we want to open the stance a couple of degrees. And what that's going to allow us to do, it's going to help us steepen the angle of attack and allow the ball, the club to get through that thick grass down to the ball and help get it out uh, back to safety. ball is nowhere near the green but it's at least back in the short grass and I'm not going to introduce any more danger of, of, of adding extra strokes onto the score. So by assessing the situation and adjusting our expectations a little bit based on what we find, uh, picking the right tool for the job and adjusting our stance a little bit, uh, we're, we're going to give ourselves the best chance to make the lowest score possible on the hole.